by the awesome beard of Aquaman. Welcome to the next episode of the Stop Click. The Stop Click. By the way, Aquaman didn't have a beard in all of them. That's what I was, trying. I was like. Oh, yeah, he had an awesome beard. Though. Yeah, well, so the, tell first... me he didn't have an awesome beard. Look at you holding your head down. Go ahead. <laughs> Yeah. Aquaman. Out of all the DC 90s characters. 90s JLA. 90s out of, JLA, out of all, he does. Out of you all the DC long, characters, who had a better beard? Dude, you know how long they took to make Aquaman get that beard? Yeah, I mean, a long I time. I remember the Aquaman. Out of all the, the DC characters, who has a better beard? Who I'm has a beard? sorry. You cannot, I remember the Aquaman riding with the Aqualad on his little seahorse <laughs> going to Atlanta. Justice League Unlimited. Aquaman was Yeah, awesome. he does. He does. They had to make him awesome. Hey. He was on thing. He was doing make him suit. So, all right. The topic M- for today. Team show. MJ here. The man from Roswell, Area 51 over here. Thank you. And you had uh, just some random guy. Just Raven. Random dude. <laughs> El Duce random Reyes. Dude. El Duce. Uh, El Duce. And the general, of course. General. Anyway, general. The topic, general for, the topic for today. Topic for today. Uh, WizKids uh, defines uh, modern as uh, DC and Marvel pieces only, yet they constantly release supplementary sets for Hobbit and Mage Knight and all these and other things, and they're well, not considered modern. They're really pushing the Yu-Gi-Oh! Hero clicks pretty soon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Coming up. The next yeah, six-month event. Now yes. it's weird for them to put product like that, but not not make them essentially playable. Well, you know there's what I mean? a, there's a reason for that though, and they, they they call them action clicks, and that's because they want them to balance within their own universe. Now, even within the action clicks, they're not compatible with another set of action clicks. You can't put hobbits with the Yu-Gi-Oh. Yeah, that's, I mean, I'm, but that, that's, I don't know. I just think that's kind of dumb. You well, there, there's a reason why for that, because they tried that a long time ago, and you know, I'm carbon dating myself uh, with um, with what they called horror clicks. Uh, mm-hmm. You remember them? They were the first set. They were the they were AVP like a, and yeah, a, 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 AVP and uh, Cthulhu. Yes, yeah. was the first big piece. Still very nice. Yeah. Um, there was also um, the Hellboy starter set, yeah. which was one of the first crossovers. Yeah, uh, from you know the horror clicks and hero clicks, because that was their attempt to making it balance. But really, kind of failed with that. Um, they also had the the first uh, wave of Marvel zombies in there. Yes, they're, they're yeah, still they did. Consider very high price to this day. Um, yeah. Just check them out on eBay. Yeah. Uh, the problem with that, with action clicks, is that one, like I say once again, they're balanced. But only within themselves. You try bringing an action click over into a, a hero click. Yeah, zone. you have some kind of unbalancing. Yeah, and with the exception of maybe a few sets. Now they did define it in the rule books uh, which sets are considered modern, but they were made in a different action. Click. Like the Star Trek Away Team yeah. uh, starter. Yeah. Attack Wing. Very strange. Yeah. Attack Wing, which is a very, which is also a very awesome game. If you guys haven't really take a look at. You know, take a look at it sometimes. It's the brother game. It's the brother game. Yeah, it's, it's, it's a very much... It's Younger a, brother. You know, you push him around. Little, <laughs> yeah, you know. I'm like, the favorite because I'm the first one. There you go. Deal. Something like that. I don't know. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> I have a little brother issue. I'm the little one in my family. So, there you go. Yeah. But, <laughs> um, but, I mean, there are good things about... I mean, there are some good sets out there. Like Mage Knight Resurrection. I think yeah. that's the last one. That was an awesome set. What was that one piece? Rainer? Oh, oh there's like a king or captain or something like that. Yeah, Rainer or Rancor. I, I don't remember what it was, but uh, we had a gentleman come in. I, I hadn't noticed that Mage Knight had had two bases. I'm like, what, what's going mm-hmm. on? Had a Hero Clicks base and a Mage Knight base. Yes. And I'm like, this is brilliant. This is a way to to segue somebody into a different part of your product line. And uh, Mage Knight obviously came out years ago. And Mage yeah. Knight, believe it or not, I bought uh, like a decade ago out of like a Babbage's. And I don't even you know if those exist anymore. I'm not even sure. I haven't been to a mall in the yeah, Babbage's. Babbage's. Yeah. Babbage's. They were like they're like a. <laughs> Um, um, electronic arts. Oh, I thought that was like some like <laughs> demon or something. No, like that. Babbages. Yeah. I, I, yes, I sold a my soul to a small soul. demon in a store. Uh, but Babbages. It, no, yeah. Babbages. But it was an electronic boutique kind of thing. Yeah. And um, I bought those and I thought they were the coolest thing in the world. They had these awesome sculpts and dragons. The guy had an archer. But I was like, this is so cool. And nobody, nobody, I had nobody to play with. I, I, I searched uh, uh, everywhere. High and low. Yes, mm-hmm. that's the word. Uh, I, I searched everywhere. I Comic stores, nobody in the area played it. So literally, I was I, I had bought these really cool figures that, and I just kind of made it the rules as I went. I, it didn't really work out in my favor, but they brought them back the last few, last few years. It he happens. made up the own rules. I didn't make up my own, own rules. Game. I did. I, I, I thought, lost his own. Game. I, I would have left that alone and let the people figure that out. That no, he I, I, that. Like, I didn't know there was like, there was no I'm map sorry. for it. So like I basically thought it was like okay, you like like uh. I basically made my own little version of Warhammer with him. I'm like, okay, well, he's got a nine rage, which means nine inches, and I move him 
six, and I would like I would kind of measure it all out and everything. And I'll be honest, it took forever to play one game, and I had no idea. Like, this is why you had to socialize, folks. Don't apparently. stay inside. Yes, Hero Cl- Hero Clicks came with maps, and it was like super easy. But 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 I, but I saw these, and it brought back memories of these really, I mean, these really cool pieces. And I like that was kind of my introduction to the whole thing. Of course, mm-hmm. back then there wasn't never anybody to play with, but uh, but I like the Mage Knight clicks because obviously the the segue into the game and their power level and their effects were so unique yeah. like I, I tried to play a game using some standard dc stuff and i got just stomped into the dirt like i was like man what happened like i i thought i was doing okay here for a second uh and i thought that was just like i mean it really realized that there could be a, a much broader meta if you actually brought some of these pieces in but the question would be would they dominate the meta yes you, you, I un, un, unequivocally you think they dominate I the think meta? they will i mean because if you look at the Hobbit clicks, they introduce a new uh, a new oh, the system, epic. The, the epic system. Which <laughs> yeah. I don't care what anybody says, that epic system blows away any team in Hero Clicks. Uh, it can. It, can. Uh, it, has, it, it has the potential for abuse. But then yeah. again, why 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 would you intentionally make something that game breaking? To to like they they make all this product and then they just segregate it so hard that nobody's buying Hobbit clicks anymore. I'll tell you why. Okay, because they, in my opinion, I think WizKids NECA was afraid to use these mechanics into the mainstream hero, hero clicks, so they wanted to test it out in other systems. Okay, then if you ever notice that these other systems used those mechanics before hero clicks adopted them to their own. Just take a so look. So that's kind of like just their, their beta testing, the test test subjects yeah. for the new mechanics? And, and you know, beta test it, we got a license. Let's use it there to do something unique. Plus, I, I think there's a certain aspect of humility when you go, my Batman just got beat by a hobbit. Like, I, I, I'm like, listen, I don't think Batman's going to lose to hobbits. I just don't think it's going to happen. I know they're cool. I don't think hey. Batman's going to get... <laughs> just consider this, okay? In the Street the street Fighter team ability was sidestep before sidestep Step existed. Became, yes, yeah, yes, it was. Became. It was cool. Oh, it was. Yes, yeah. it Wasn't was. It? Wow. Hobbit. Hobbit. But Batman loses some hobbits or Gandalf. I mean, I, I, mean, I think Gandalf I, we can let yeah, Gandalf. Slide. Okay, but the thing okay. is, but Gandalf. But, but, I mean, but, I'm not letting Frodo do it. <laughs> Frodo, Frodo, is Frodo, not, Frodo comes up and 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 Frodo and, with smacks, the ring? Uh-uh, and, and smacks and smacks down Batman, uh-uh. and you're like, what just happened to me? What? <laughs> like, what, what? What am I doing with my life? And then well, is, do you think that that kind of power balance issue is keeping people from? Investing in these other products? Yes. Probably. Yeah. I, I don't think they, I mean, even I mean, in this store, I don't think they sell. Yeah. I mean, we've had ours sitting up on there for, we bought one when it first came out, when the movie came out, and it's still sitting up wow. there, folks. Yeah. Because uh, nobody wants to play them, man. Well, it's, and it's not because of the popularity of them, because yeah. people identify a lot of these. Yeah. Clicks. Yeah. It's just they did, they know that when they see action clicks on there, yeah. that they can't, then, yeah. that their venue nine times out of ten is not going to use it. They, now, yeah. I will say this. Now, um, there are some venues out there that call, that use Silver Age. Yeah, uh, Silver Age. I'm, I'm, I'm one of those. Yeah, we'll, we'll give them a description of what Silver Age Silver is. Silver Age, in a, in, a, in a nutshell, is any character that has a card. Okay? That's that's pretty much Silver Age. Uh, you can't use any type of battle feats or condition. Mm-hmm. Okay? You cannot use those because those will uh, yeah. uh, unbalance it. But and that's it. You know, you bring your team. You know, so long as it has a card, They're you legal. got it. You know, and that, and I think that's a that, that in a in a sense um, brings a lot of more value to those characters because sure, I yeah. like a lot of pieces from the past, mm-hmm. uh, from Hammer, Hammer of Thor on up. I mean, I still have my scrolls, my super yeah. scrolls from from um, Web of Spider Man. I still use them, and they're still a viable team. You mentioned Hammer of Thor, <laughs> and I'm just like, I love Thor, Frog of Thunder. Like, I don't even care if you can play. Like, I, like I'll be honest, that that is that is one of my all time pieces. I mean, like every time you find somebody that owns one. They won't trade it. No. They won't trade it for anything. No. And I'm like, but I want a frog. I want to destroy people with a frog. With you, Mjolnir. I want, I want it to happen. Uh, and, and it's good. I mean, and that, that set, even though it's, it's like, it's considered legendary, I guess you want to say, the Hammer yeah. Thor, because you, you could try and buy a case, a, a, just a booster of it. It's like 20, 23. Oh, yeah, yeah, no, they're expensive now. Yeah, yeah, they're pretty bad. Yeah, but we, we hopefully next year they'll, they'll, they will, you know, change some things. Well, I mean... They're putting a lot of attention on this Yu-Gi-Oh stuff. We just finished our War of Light. Our next yep. big event is 
Yu-Gi-Oh! Battle Yu-Gi-Oh! for the Millennium Puzzle. Yeah. Yu-Gi-Oh! Really has minds. a lot of potential, though. Yeah, I mean, it look does. But you think they're going to make a modern? You think, no. You, know, you, you no. don't think with... I, the thing is, I think it's going to hurt in the long run. I, yeah, I think I mean, that I think it's stores... A oh, I, I think stores are ta- might actually end up taking a big risk because just because yeah. you have... I mean, if you say, I'm a modern age store, then you're saying, if you play at these events, you can't use these at any other events unless I go out of my way to make it happen. Exactly. And, and I, that's, I'm like, that's 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 daunting to a store. to go, I'm, I'm going to commit on some booster br- br- bricks. And, or actually, I don't know if they're bricks yet. No, they're gravity feet. Are they gravity feet? Yeah, yeah, okay. But I'm, you're going to have to commit on those things and, and hope that your turn, out, your turn out flies. You know, I'm like, that's kind of... It's kind of scary to a store, you know, that you have a lot of unused products sometimes. But see, it, it would take somebody that actually knows Heroclip, uh, the, the Yu-Gi-Oh, to actually push that. That's, yeah. the, that's the secret to it. That's yeah. the key. If, you ha- if, you're, if you're a judge and you have knowledge about Yu-Gi-Oh, you have an edge over anybody else because you can actually, ent- you, can, you can hype it up and make it more appealing for us oh, Heroclix yeah. fans. Yeah. I mean, I'm a Heroclix guy. You know, I would love to get to get get to know more about you know Yu-Gi-Oh. Yeah. But with me only knowing a base amount of Yu-Gi-Oh, <clears throat> you know, it just it it just it, it's it's I just lost my thought <laughs> because John Constantine just walked in the room and he's Sorry, throwing a spell. Salsa, salsa yeah, dancing over yeah, here. Yeah, yeah, I got a salsa dance. dance. So, yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yu-Gi-Oh yeah. dance. I didn't know such a thing existed, <laughs> oh, but wow. anyway. Well, uh, but, Urban Dictionary. <laughs> Oh is that something we can? Well, we'll okay, yeah, we'll have to fix that one editing. Okay. Anyway, so uh, back to uh, but so being obviously, I think you know, I mean, the stores are going to take kind of a big risk on this one, and I think there's a little bit of a motivation problem trying to bring people in. I mean, you, I mean, War of Light, you had no problem bringing people yeah, in because people DC. would come from miles away to yeah. go to multiple events, Cause, and it was great because everybody knows that in Hero Clicks Land, they Wiz Kids love DC and they love <laughs> the Green Lantern. They do. Okay. Everybody loves Green Lantern. Oh, yeah. They, will, they, they break themselves on Green Lantern. They do. They do. And they, Kingdom Come, Green Lantern? Oh, yeah. They the bald dude. Well, King, the well, any of the Kingdom Come. 12 Rain, Drum oh, yeah. Shot. Kingdom, Kingdom, Kingdom Come Kingdom itself. Shot. Yeah, there's a lot of good stuff. Another story, another yeah. day. Another trust story. me. Uh, okay, but yeah. Uh, so we know how, how everybody feels about the Green Lantern. The power players love them because they offer an awesome carry ability. You just need one, it carries yeah. out. You ever notice that none of these Lanterns had the Green Lantern? I did notice. None of the team team ability. I was like, I was a little disappointed. That's kind of, no, I'm kind of good with yeah, that's that kind of that would have broken the game if you had all these kids. Like, oh yeah, I I, I can see that. Sodom, Sodom yeah, it's broken enough. Let's let's yeah. let him carry everybody on the first turn. Might well, be that, a little. And <laughs> none of the other lanterns have a team ability. You know? Oh, that's true. That's true. And, and on top of that, you know, we now have a. a, a army of lanterns out there that are actually competitive oh very competitive yeah. well, I, I like a lot i'll be honest the flash has confirmed to print one of my favorite characters of all time it's a very unusual character the midnighter i love the midnighter the midnighter is, uh, uh, is hilarious and strange all at the same time oh, that's the uh batman guy that, the, the, yeah, the, the, yeah, the batman yeah. analog he's, he's supposed he's, to be the better version he, he's the grant morrison's batman yeah, yeah. If, you, if you know if you've read the authority comic yeah. You will enjoy this this set, okay? Yeah. Because oh yeah, I'm I'm an authority fan. Yeah, and I'm I'm a, I'm actually excited about DC right now. Mm-hmm. I'm I'm not <laughs> one for DC. I'll be the first to admit. Okay, but got a flash shirt on. He's like, I'm not one for yeah. DC. I only oh, own no, this no, shirt. That's a different flash. That's, that's a different, this, this flash. Is a flash. different flash. flash Fair enough. Right, look it up. Oh. <laughs> 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 so, but well, all that all that aside, you with know, um, oh, go ahead. Sorry. Uh, well, with all that aside, we will be uh, unboxing a flash, uh, some flash. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Once uh, yeah. we'll put place some orders, we'll be unboxing the flash. See what we get. Uh, we're gonna talk. About the Flash, probably yeah. in the next. All the know, Flash has history. a great Rose Gallery too. I, I, they're goofy. I'll be honest, a lot of them are goofy. Well, like that, that new, <laughs> the new Fifty Two reboot made them kind of serious. Oh yeah, no, I, I, but, but, but then again, you still have a guy named Rainbow Raider. No, be wrong. <laughs> like, like I mean, I, like the, and he's surfing on a rainbow. He is. He I is. can't help but think of reading Rainbow a little uh, bit. Uh, Lamar, Lamar Burton. Lamar Burton. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Jordan. Jordan. Anyway, so but anyway, so uh, back to back to the back to the topic at hand. Obviously, I think. I think I think WizKids could. I want them to move more towards the area of finding ways to incorporate not just DC well, and Marvel. I think, into I think Yu-Gi-Oh Marvel. is probably the most balanced set outside of DC and Marvel. Uh, yeah, I don't think I've seen any well, they, broken. They, they have pieces. the trap mechanic. 
Oh yeah, and but you can easily take that out of the equation whenever you're putting them against Marvel or DC because right. you yeah. don't really need them. And not to mention, there's not some overbearing trap mechanic either. It's not like it's not yeah. over. It's not. A well, even though you say trap mechanic, didn't the uh, Marvel? Uh, what is it? The DC Batman is, sixty. Yeah. Batman sixty six had, had the crazy yeah. death yeah, trap yeah, thing. Yeah. The first time I ever played against the, uh, the 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 sixty six Batman team. He started putting these death traps everywhere, and I didn't understand the mechanic fully until I was getting beat single-handedly by it. <laughs> I'm like, what What just happened to me? What was happening yeah. a minute ago? And see, and that's, in my opinion, that's another way that they're trying to introduce a new mechanic in there and see what yeah. people yeah. think about. Yeah. So, so, that's true. I would uh, mind trap. Wrap this up. Your favorite Golden Age, not allowed, sanctioned, piece or set? Um, yeah, go ahead. Uh... The Gandalf. I don't know which Hobbit which Hobbit said it was because there's three of them. The Gandalf from that was so utterly surprising to me, and I'm like, you know what? I I could completely play that anywhere that I could play Hero. I mean, I, it, it was good power level. I felt like it brought something new to the game, and I really enjoyed. The, at least the epic action. <laughs> oh wow! Uh, for me, uh, I would have to say it's the aliens versus the aliens from the ah, aliens. Ah, alien versus predator. Yeah. There was nothing that scared people more as kids as watching the movie Aliens. <laughs> oh, okay? yeah. And, and seeing it, and so you got a mother right there, and you got all these different that types of aliens. Set, right? Yeah, yeah that yeah, came I've never seen set. that like Walmart. Whiz kids, bring it back. Okay, <laughs> you're bring all about the horror back, clicks. Okay? Bring it the horror Not clicks. the horror clicks, just the aliens versus predator. Bring it to bring it to to hero click. We will play it. We will yeah, buy it. True. Yeah. We'll buy it. Uh, mine, I, 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 two. One's a future piece that mm. I've seen some images of the sculpt. I'm really excited for. And the other one's uh, from a set we didn't even talk about, which is Halo. Ooh. Oh, right. The yeah, Halo right. ones are actually pretty fun. I like the Halo uh, pieces, but my my favorite from that is a scarab. Mm. Y'all seen that thing? No, I've okay. not seen it. This thing is like okay. this huge, <laughs> like bigger than Doctor Manhattan. Like this mm. thing is big. Massive. You should look it up, dude. Okay. Like, it's got like four. It's got a dial for each leg. Yeah. Yeah, I have never seen this piece. Yeah, I, like, I, I thought I was well versed in all this. No, okay, and fair the, enough. And the, yeah. the future one, actually, and it's funny because I'm actually a pretty good Yu Gi Oh fan, big Yu Gi Oh fan, of course, childhood. But um, the God figures, the God cards. Mm -hmm. oh, I have no idea okay. what you're talking about. Well, in the world oh, of Yu Gi Oh, in the world of Yu Gi Oh, they're they're. <laughs> and granted, this is a cartoon; it's over dramatic. There are three cards in the set. An entire set that are like are just game breakingly powerful. Okay. Like game breakingly powerful. Like you. Is this, is this carrying over to the click world? Is that what's yeah, going to happen? Okay. Oh, you're talking have about like own... Exodia and everything. Exo they have oh, an Exodia oh, sculpt too. I'm pretty I'm excited lost. about. Exodia. Oh, are you serious? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> they're, they're having like these new pieces. I'm super because I've been watching the cartoon again. Just watching because... Raven fanboy out. Yeah. Yeah. I'm excited. I'm really excited. <laughs> Understand what what Raven is going through here, Clix. I have the, the edge. Exod the edge. Yeah, you you're just talking about. Yeah, exactly. I am the edge. Exodia. And this is just a little bit in the. To Yu Gi Oh, he these cards. If you collected all five of the cards and play them on the field, the game was over yeah. automatically. Yeah, okay, right. that's what he's bringing back. And yeah, Exodia, they, yeah. But the um, God cards, like everybody feared them, and they're awesome, and like they look cool too. They look really cool, yeah. mm -hmm. and I'm just excited to see those. I'm really excited to see those. Okay, that's yeah. why world of play. The second we get a chance to, we're jumping into the Yu Gi Oh thing head cool. first, no fears. And because of that, what I'm going to start doing is the store is going to start being Silver Age. For all of their tournaments. That, well, like that way, you can bring your Yu-Gi-Oh, you can bring your Scarab, you can bring your Hobbit. Bioshock Infinite. Yeah, Bioshock, <laughs> Gears Assassin's of War. Creed. You can bring your Street Fighters. Oh, we, I, forgot I, we forgot to say the Gears Street. of War. <laughs> yeah. Sesame Street. They brought, yeah, there, there you go. Sesame Click. By the way, I Hello Kitty Click. Wiz Kids, if they just I'm, a million dollar Hello. idea. Pokemon Hero Clicks. No, I think Nintendo, I, Nintendo. Pokemon. Pokemon. I know they. Pokemon, I, I know they would never do it. Yeah, right. I'm just saying, I, if they wanted to print money, you can't. You can't even use. Other card sleeves. Other oh, really? Pokemon mm -hmm. officially sanctioned sleeves. I did not know any of this. this yeah, is for the yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, cool fair. Oh, a big well, that and just blank sleeves. Are the blank sleeves are Pokemon official sleeves. Because apparently there was some there was some Pokemon card sleeve cheating going yeah, on. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, oh, I was thirteen year old. But here I am talking about Yu Gi Oh. Little kids. <laughs> but um, yeah. Little so kids. future uh, tournaments. Once Yu Gi Oh hits, I think it's in February. Everything's going to be Silver Age. And if yeah. you have a card, bring your Frog of Thunder. I don't care. <laughs> bring all of it. It's going to be awesome. I want to see the Frog of Thunder take out a Scarab. Uh, listen, I'm a little terrified of seeing uh, Kingdom Come Super. Man, either one of them come back around because those are terrifying. But I'll buckle down. I'll make it work. We'll make it happen. <laughs> awesome. Um, for the stop click, Thank I'm you. Raven. I'm John. MJ. 
Yeah. <laughs> MJ. Yeah, exactly. Thank y'all um, for watching. Can I, can I bring my uh, growing pains here, Clicks? Oh, yeah, your growing yes, pains yeah. here. I've got Doogie Hauser at home. Oh, also, <laughs> also, he heals sure. forever. <laughs> I'll heal everything. Doogie oh. Hauser heals whatever. If you have any suggestions, <laughs> comments, or anything like that, please let us know. Please do. Yeah, uh, yeah we love it. talking about this. We love interacting with people. You know, it'd be awesome. So if you have any comments or suggestions for future shows, give us a shout. Let us know. And I'm really glad that I saved my uh, my Zach from Saved by the Bell. I know it was overpowered, <laughs> but... Uh, Wait a minute, does it? Zach, and he has that big, he has a big cell phone. Big, no, that's a power base. That's, that's a power base. base. That's, that's, a, that's, that's a resource. That's a resource. resource. Yeah, there you go. Okay, okay. Be able to be the what, only kid in school. What's the one with the one that, that played in Showgirls? Does she like, does yeah, she like just, battle?